Hello everyone and welcome to Aver. Aver is a four-year Maria Skladowska Curie Innovative Training Network, bringing together 12 partner organizations, five early stage researchers, and five universities from Finland, Czech Republic, Italy, Romania, and Spain to work on wearables. Wearables are small and mobile devices with various communications capability that are incorporated into gadgets or clothes which can be worn on or in the human body, like smart helmets, watches, phones, boots, life beds, rings, and many other things. These devices are connected wirelessly. They are small, friendly, portable, and convenient. Wearables help us to track our physical activity. Do not forget about medicine. Always be in touch. Discover new realities. Be safe here. Do not lose our way and our smaller friends. Wearables are used in numerous applications. Some of these are sport, healthcare, lifestyle, pets and animals, entertainment and education, and industry. Today we are going to focus on industrial and healthcare domains where wearables are targeting and preserving human safety. Let's start with industry. According to the International Labour Organization, annually around 1.9 people gain work-related diseases and 2.3 million people die from work accidents, in total at least 4.2 million cases. To compare, 35% of countries have a population less than this number. But how wearables can benefit to reduce the work mortality rate and amount of injuries? By performing four main functions. First, monitoring. Monitoring of both vital and environmental parameters. Second, tracking. Here we are talking about worker location, preventing struck by moving machinery, and creating a general picture of the production process. Third, supporting. Wearables contribute to increasing the physical capabilities, facilitating communication, and simplification of information management. And finally, wearables can help to train workers. So, in general case, the data collected by monitoring, tracking, supporting, and training industrial variables is available to work safety manager. It helps him effectively organize evacuations, send help where it is needed, and distribute workforce avoiding overloads. All this affects the decrease of mortality and accident rate in industries. Now, let's discuss the role of variables in healthcare. Wearables can be used for diabetic patients in diagnosis and management of neurocognitive disorders, muscle traumas, cardiovascular diseases, sleeping disorders, psychological disorders, in field of gerontology, in combating COVID-19, and in many other fields. For example, how wearables can affect COVID-19. It helps in stress management, diagnosis, tracking of symptoms, current and management, social distance, contact tracing and prevention from infection, which eventually reduces the infection rate. And all of this is just a little part of the, what wearables can do. However, the more technology provides opportunities, the more open research questions. And there are really a lot of them. And as a part of our project, early stage researchers are trying to deal with some of them. And who are those early stage researchers? My name is Viktoria Shubina, and I'm an early stage researcher at the AWARE project. I'm working on privacy aspects in wireless IoT localization on wearable devices. Hello everyone, I am Salva Safi, an early stage researcher in EWARE project. I work on cellular communication technologies for industrial wearable applications. Hi, I'm Olga and I'm early stage researcher at the AWARE project. My research interests include uh, wearable computing, wireless communication, age computing and also social and dynamic. This is Leskminsk and I work in the IWARE project. I am dealing with the variables for the healthcare and the usage of the machine approaches for variables. I am Nadir Tuchukno and uh, as an early stage researcher at AWARE program, I am working on the device to device and multicast communications for wearable devices. My name is Tomasz Bravenets and I am looking for privacy and security issues related to indoor localization as an early stage researcher in the AWARE project. My name is Lucia Klus and I work on indoor localization. Hi, I am Asad Ali and I am doing research on millimeter wave capabilities in extended reality applications. My name is Lauda Fleda Todo and the topic of my thesis is indoor localization with ultra wideband signals. I am Pavel Pascasio, my research is focused on colorative indoor position systems. Hello everyone, my name is Asma Chena and I work on e health wearables. Hi. I'm Walid Bin Kaim and I'm working on edge computing for wearable networks. Good day, my name is Virtoka Katerina and I'm working on industrial wearables for work safety.
whatever means for us. Even for me is envisioning the future. Collaboration among countries with researchers which are at different levels of their careers. There are means for me the community. Of gaining a valuable experience. It's a project where I get to do the thing I'm passionate about. The opportunity to work and collaborate with many people from different countries and uh, receive a feedback from different angles of the research field. An opportunity to face current challenges regarding indoor position system using wearables devices. Either allows me to develop new algorithms in order to improve it. It's an opportunity to come out of the shell. For me, aware means unity and diversity. It's a gateway to an exciting career. It's people interested in world and science. Thank you. Stay tuned and follow us.